Welcome to another episode of the Kinseed series. Pause. So, if you're paying close attention, you may notice a problem. Like the fact that the video is taking up only the corner of the screen. This is actually something that Kinseed always does. Uh, I have a special settings in OBS that uh, sizes it up to be full screen, but somehow I recorded this entire video without noticing it. So I'm going to try to make it fit the screen post recording. Uh, so if it looks a little strange this time around, that's why. Apologies. But back to the rest of the video. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of the Kinseed series. And I have two things I want to accomplish today. First off, it is the chicken market. So that's where I'm going to head now. The other thing is it is somebody's birthday. So I want to grab that as well. Let's see, we have an account summary. We gained 190 brass and we gained 105 reputation. Yay! Just also, before we go, check the change log. We're good there. Can never remember which of the two other markets sells the chickens. <laughs> oh no! They say tomatoes banish the pale. They found. And found they are within the veil. Hmm. Aha! It is this market. Alright. Yay! Bidding mode. Uh, exit. Now I'll bid. So I could not see with everybody's <laughs> info. So five brass for this guy. I didn't see his traits, so... Wow, that chicken sold for 10 brass. <laughs> New chicken. Oh, it's Fable. Bad speed. Quality poor. I have them. I don't want it. <laughs> but it is friendly. Wow, this one's gone up to 11. <laughs> That's selling better than the last chicken. Alright, now for our last chicken. Julian. Bad speed. Average quality. That's good. And angry. <sighs> I did bid once for the, the middle chicken just because it was um, happier. Wow. I got it for eight brass. <laughs> Nobody wanted that chicken. The others were 10 and 11. Where did that just come? Ah, huh, right. I'll run through here real quick, see what I can see, and then we'll head off to the birthday girl. A note. A clucker is only ready to lay when it sees you once per day. Oh, interesting. Oh, oh. I almost missed that guy. A favorite gift and very cheap candy hair, the useful sweet. I guess we need to start trying to gift that to everybody. Oh, this is one of the furthest inland landfish I've ever seen. <laughs> when the trees are gold and brown, firefish hide and can't be found. Huh. That's a useful information. Ooh. Do I need to fish that? <laughs> when tiredness comes home to roost, a tasty pear can give a boost. Hmm. Does it keep you up at night, or...? Are they going to give us energy at some point? Uh, let's go ahead and talk to Roger readily. Oh! Can we do a favor? Sure. Give this to Ignatius Kettle. Hurry along then, thanks. That's not why I wanted to talk though. How are you? Are you a bit down? You have... You have something that you like? No. I wonder if you'd like charm weed. Nope. All right, so we want to find the right button and then find Hazelnut. Let's get her and her kid mixed up, I think. Hazelnut is the daughter. Okay, I'm gonna run home, grab some milk, and then we can do this. Take it to her. All right, got some milk. I apparently don't have the map here, still. 
Luckily I have a general idea of where this is. There you are. Hello. Feeling ill? That's not fun on your birthday. Ah, here's the milk. Very generous of you, friendship up. And it likes us. Here's a secret I heard. Millie Cow doesn't like mushroom pie. So I'm getting the feeling you shouldn't just randomly gift mushroom pie. I also would not like a mushroom pie. Not a fan of mushrooms. Usually tolerate something that tastes like mushrooms. But the texture. So gross. Ah, poop. I was trying to harvest something and then right as I was about to click harvest, I scrolled. So I guess we're here now. So I guess I'm gonna head to bed and then we'll see what tomorrow brings. Oop, I'm gonna feed these guys. Alright, I went ahead and cooked some mess for him. Just cooking some gassy apples down. Like a puppy applesauce. Uh, let's see, what else could we make? I'll probably try to make some more simple things do. Ah, this, I think, is also the thing that, um... Hazel would have had... This was her other like, I think. This and milk. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna make it. I think I put the water in... too early. Here's something that would be fun, kinda nice to get from Fairweather. It would be like a um, vessel of infinite water of some sort. So you don't have to, <laughs> after every recipe, go get more water. You would just always have some. That would be very nice. So it kinda looks like if I... So I filled the glass jar. I accidentally poured some out, so I tried to interact with it again. And I think it filled up my bucket. Let's go ahead and see if that's how that worked. Okay, so oh, I still have water in my jar. I'll cook that one more time. Okay, so let's scoop it up with the glass jar. We do it again, the tin bucket. All right, cool. So now we've filled up all three containers without having to switch to them. And off to bed. Made some apple bread, I made uh, apple pie, made some mess for good old puppy. Good morning guys. I can feed you guys this morning so you aren't sleeping together. Almost gave the cat a pear. Don't think she would have enjoyed that. Oh yeah! It's our other chicken! Hi! What? <laughs> you should not be able to write a chicken. Alright. So we got... Look at our pumpkin! Get ready? Yep. Pumpkin. I wouldn't recommend it. He didn't like gooseberry. I'm just gonna get daily reports on the things he doesn't like. Oop, a note. Need a present for a birthday? Candy squirrels, a giveaway. Check the calendar. We gotta give a rose to Ignatius. And we could raise our chickens. So the kettle would be... By Candle Witch. Oh, Traveling Trader. Alright then. Huh, you could actually like give him gifts and stuff. Alright. Give him an apple. Oh, there's the kettle. Let me look in here real quick. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have those. Plenty of those, so. Here's your rose of romance. And do we have any of your likes? No. Let's give him... Oh! Blueberries! He likes blueberries. Do you have any gossip? Birthday is 14th of spring. Okay. It's a book. Are you? Wow. He really had to go. He got here so fast. A dog has many enemies in the natural world, although only the ones found in the dark forests can actually eat a dog. Sometimes they will cook the dog, and this is called a hot dog. <laughs> a dog will protect its master from attack and will warn of dangerous presences with a whimper or a growl. Or less. 
dangerous ones. If your dog dies, then please remember that it will be absorbed into the circle of life and likely come back to you to visit you in a, as a small newt or a buttercup. Although you may need to visit the buttercup as they have no legs. <laughs> oh no. In pools with rocks, fast asleep, awful stench troll the deep. In the veil, you will see river trout, happy as can be. Hey, hello. What do we got here? I don't know if cabbage or some lettuce. That'll do. This we'll see here. Lettuce. Reputation. Okay. Yes, I could go down one. Ooh, a fun flower. Just what she needs. Seven coin. And she's happy with it. Nice. Ooh. Not the customer. Hello. I don't know if she's a kid or not. And we don't know. We don't know her age. Hello there. Like to think she was saying that to the pie and or to the bread and not me. She was walking by like, oh hello, I need that. Uh, all right, it's a little expensive. Hello, sir. Do I have some fresh blueberry pie? Nine. Very happy with it. All right, yeah. I say fresh, but I honestly have no memory of when I baked that apple pie. <laughs> uh, also known as blueberry pie. I think I may need to make more of. Yeah. There we go. Made two more, I think. Okay. Yay. Oh, she didn't even want to barter for that. Gonna try to make whatever uh, item they sell, uh, buy. So we don't end up running out. Yay. Big after help this lady. I'll be closing up shop. I wonder if her skirt has a gold trim or silver trim. Gold? Gold? Silver. Gold. Does look cool with the silver. How do you? Hello. How are you doing? The radish. Oh, I'm excited to see what price this works at. I don't think anyone's bought a radish yet. Just straight up farewell. Okay. So it probably could go down one. Thank you. Oh, the shop is closed. I think we were about to have another one. Oh well. You was too slow. I should give these guys something. I don't know that I've given either of them gifts before. Don't want to give her the brothy grim. I think I can manage that. A fun flower. Anything for you? Any likes? Nope. Oh, she has a fever. Uh, deliver a sunflower to Cecilia. Alright. How are you? Give her a sun fun flower. She's in Poppy Hill. Alright, let's go see if we can find Miss Salt. Oh, a note. We. There we go. Fun flower dance, fun flower sway, having at mists to go away. Waving at mists to go away. Oh, aha. He's even up. Convenient. Hello. How are you? Yeah, yeah, I can do a favor. You need charm weed. Alright. I can do that. Your kiddo's crying. You might want to help him out. Alright. Meetings. Yeah. She needs a charm weed. And then. She also needs a fun sunflower. And then while I'm here. Let's go ahead and see if she likes sunflowers. I think it's now past midnight. Let us see. What's all root? Used for healing or to make food look nicer. Didn't you? Aha! It's a past midnight thing. 
When I was editing, I was like, oh, it's so close to midnight. It was like an hour or two off. Which is why I could not find it. I feel like there's another... Aha! Here it is. Yay! Right, now that we've stayed up so late, we should probably head to bed. Oh, look at all those chicken eggs. I think that's going to be where I end it for today. We got ourselves a new chicken! So excited to have two chickens now. They're just showing us their butts. Could you both turn around? There's one. Could you not stand? How am I supposed to get a good thumbnail with you two? Hmm? Anyway, hope you guys have enjoyed this episode and until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.